Hello testers, in the last video, we have created the page objects and also we have moved all the locators to the JSON files, right? So now let us continue. Let's try to create the base page today. And before that, if you remember, we have not moved this particular, uh, we can say locator to the locator file. Okay, the reason being is everything is object, but when it comes to the this particular one, it is taking this is a string and this is an object. The same thing is here also. But when you pass this particular thing from the JSON file, the things may vary. Let's try to do that and we will come to know. So what we are going to do, go to which page is this login page. We are okay. Now go to your login page JSON. So here. I have already added button, continue button, locator is link, which is good. You can see the locator is link and the additional options are name and continue, right? So name equal to continue action options. So now what, what will happen is when you try to say, let's say you want to pass object, right? No problem here. What you can say login page dot. Okay. Dot continue button dot action options, no issues, but does it work here? Let's see dot continue button dot okay locator okay so now you can see we are getting the error the reason being is if you take a look at the get by role this particular one will take this as a union type that means this will accept only the methods methods which are listed over here anything any value which is not this type it is never going to accept but what we are sending from this particular one is a string, right? So this particular JSON is all about string, right? This particular one. So now this is never going to be work. Okay. What we can do here is I will declare a variable. Okay. Constant my element. Okay. Equal to. Okay. Here I will say uh, locator value. Or else you can say this one. Okay is okay we are giving alias alias of which type any of these types any of these types simply copy paste and then you can see the error is no longer now so all you can do just pass your element then you will not see any error the reason is as i said earlier get by role accept only the values which are specified this is called union type in the typescript we have a concept of Union type that means you can restrict a variable to pass only the values which are you want. It's kind of enum enumeration if you're coming from Java background, right? The same thing over here. What we have done, whatever the value we are taking, so eyes we are saying simply. Okay, so now if you pass it and if you run it, this will work. Okay, so now the only problem here is in future if any typescript version changes and they add even more types you have to come and change it okay because we are not sure uh, what are all the values they are going to add or remove okay you have to be up to date so this is what one disadvantage we can see okay so now let us continue with our original topic creating the base page okay so i'm gonna come over here write base page base page base page base page that ts okay so here obviously We'll create a class and we name it as base page. This base page concept is not mandatory. Remember that. Okay. So we don't want to create this particular uh, page in every place, right? It doesn't make any sense. So anyway, we are going to extend it. So we'll simply say this dot page. Okay. Is of type page. Just simply say control space and right click and format. There you go. Right. So now what have we have to do we have to extend because this page is not present because it is defined in the you know uh, base page so we can simply say extends extends base page okay so we have to import the base page we are okay with that import slash which is pages dot base page okay base page so why it is not coming because we have to 
export default that's it i hope it should come now base page right because we have exported it so now if you remember i think we should not remove uh, remove the constructor the, the reason being i will tell you what we have to do we have to add a constructor here for sure okay the only thing is that instead of writing this one we have to use parent class constructor super of page super of page why we still getting the error because we have marked this as a private we can mark it as a protected so that one level you can access it okay so simple we have just moved the concept of page to the base page we will be adding so many methods here okay so time being we just moved only the page object okay so this page is done simply copy this and go to your or else you can copy this go to your home page right here also you can do the same thing okay extends extends base page okay so once you expand you don't need to write like this you can simply say super of page super of page okay so now it is a bit of clear right so every page should be extending the base page we will be writing some methods over here remember this approach is not a mandatory it depends upon your uh, it depends upon your uh, approach that you have in your uh, project and uh, things that you have. So we cannot definitely say that you have to have a base page for sure. Okay. So I think this is good. If you run it, it should work. Okay. So if it is working fine, in the next video, we will try to add the pages. What pages we will add? I mean, uh, what methods we will be adding? Let's say async click. Okay. Async click. And then we will be adding the methods to, you know, perform the click operations and all okay not now we'll try to run this one and if it is working fine in the next video we are gonna add these base page we will be getting so many like click method check method right uncheck method different things you can try over here okay selecting the wrapped and everything you can do right so by time being leave it as it is and try running it if it is working fine because importantly i'm curious over here because we have uh you know we can say uh, instead of string we have to pass it as a union type okay so let's try running it cd cucumber js so npm test i hope no failures yeah the last couple of videos our videos are ending with the failures only hopefully Okay, browser is launched. My account, superb, right? So no mistakes now, this time continue and the second test will continue the same thing. So this in this video, we have done nothing. We are just simply created a base page and moved our initialization of the page to the super page, I mean base page, parent page. Okay, so go over here, base page is where this particular page will be given to each and every page object which we are good okay so next session what we will do we will try to implement these clicks okay the reason why i selected this approach is you will come to know when the reporting part when we include the reporting part html report you will get to know what is the reason behind it okay so thanks for watching stay tuned see you in the next video